Okay, um, round five. Drop a rock, but uh, when you, when I see opponents with double rock, I don't expect the other than Graveler because purely because I've got red period. Um, again, they've got Vespi Quen rather than be, uh, than Beedrill, so I like Venusaur. Um, Venusaur lead looks ni looks nice here. Um, I do like Red Pyria, um, because it has um, wins against Graveler, Vespiquen, and Frostlass. It also picks up Pseudo Udo when we're running the zeros. Um, so I quite like um, quite like Red Pyria late game, and then I always like Lapras save switch with the Venusaur lead. So I need to take out. Venusaur with Venusaur here, um, or double shield Malapras, so that's something I'm going to bear in mind. Okay, so Umbreon leads, so I'm going to go straight to Lapras and go for the uh, go for the Skull Bash, try and win the zeros. Uh, he hasn't switched Sudorudo in yet, which is good. Uh, so that suggests suggests to me that he probably hasn't got Sudorudo in the back, which is good for Rhyperia. And I've drawn in his Venusaur, which is excellent for my Rhyperia. Oh, but he gets the Frenzy Plant. Um, I'll shield that just to force a shield back in return. And the defense boost is going to make me very hard for him to farm down. See, he blocks that as expected. Um, hopefully, I can get another surf. Yeah. So he has to shield this, I think. No. Oh, great play. Great call. Um. So I'm going to go into Venusaur and farm. Three Vine Whips, which is great. That's sort of more than halfway to a Frenzy Plant. In comes the Umbreon. Oh, he's not got Vespi quite in the back. I think he's got Frostlass in the back. So I want to save my shield for Rhyperia to beat Frostlass in the one shield. Um, it struggles in the zeros because of Avalanche doing so much damage. I think he's got Frostlass in the back here. So you wouldn't you wouldn't bring that into Venusaur at an energy disadvantage. Um, and this is perfect because now I can. Uh, not shield the Venusaur and take the shield advantage into uh, with Rhyperia into the last match and beat whatever he has left. Oh, it's annoying that I didn't get the Frenzy Plant there. Um, but again, not on a shield. I'm going to farm this down with um, with Smackdowns and then I can take on anything else. I'm going to shield just in case it is Sudorudo in the back. It is. So what I want to do here is throw a superpower just before he gets to um, the stone edge, uh, the rock slide, sorry, because I don't want to weaken my um, fast moves and my defenses. So I'm able to throw the superpower to kill and then another one to kill the Umbreon. My period coming in clutch again. Okay, so we saw that um, they brought Venusaur, Sududo, and Umbreon. Um, it was a you know it was a close game, so I'm not expecting anything drastic. So I'm going to lead Frost last to try and catch either Venusaur or Sududo. Um,
I have my sudo safe switch um, as you could you could um, it'll switch Venusaur into it but I might be able to get enough energy to get to a rock slide first which, which Venusaur won't enjoy taking and then Venusaur in the back which is fantastic with shield down so let's try that So seeing how, um, again, he's seen that I'm not afraid to use Rhyperia, so he's got to really worry about it now, I think. Uh, so I'm really not expecting the Alolan Graveler um, or the Vespiquen. Um, I mean, maybe the Vespiquen, because otherwise Venusaur is difficult for him to beat. So let's see. Mirror. Um... This is interesting. I have a really good IV Frostlass, so I'm going to lose CMP here. But he doesn't know that, so I'm going to go for a bait. I tapped it just before he did, so it, for all he knows, this is probably a Shadow Ball. So yeah, he has to shield. Fantastic. Um, I'll shield in case it's a Shadow Ball. But it's not. Okay, so it'll it be scary for him to go for two. Oh, but I've got nothing to switch in. I get there first again, so that's fine. Blocks it. No, I'm gonna let this through. Um, yeah, because. Oh, wow. There we go. So this is great. Yeah, because with the way the game's worked at the minute, you don't always know that you've not lost a fast move. So I didn't want to go into the zero shields uh, and lose um, lose on CMP there. So I'm now able to go to Sudorudo and build up to a rock slide and, and a half. So I didn't go for it there because I knew I'd have lost to CMP. Or I thought we'd, I thought we'd be clicking at the same time. Um, and I didn't want to lose CMP. So this way, uh, I can go for a few more counters and get close to the next rock slide. And I've got Venusaur in the shields down in the in the back now, which is fantastic. Um, so I'm going to go for the rock slide. And I'm going to let him get one more vine whip through. And then switch to Venusaur to hopefully, my own Venusaur to hopefully try and catch a sludge bomb. Oh, it wasn't. Mm, that's so annoying. I was trying to switch and it wasn't letting me. That's really annoying. Okay, so here, a sludge bomb from him isn't going to kill me. So there's no real rush for me to go to the Frenzy Plant. Um, so I'm going to over farm again. I'm just hoping he's not got a Vespiquen in the back, which it looks like he hasn't, otherwise he'd be swapping in. So I'm able to farm up and go for a, a Frenzy Plant, and I'm just praying here that he's got Sudorudo or Graveler in the back. Oh, but it's Vespiquen, damn it. So next game, just going for the Sludge Barn just because. So we saw Frostlass, Vespiquen, and uh, Venusaur there. So again, that would have been a really nice game for me to bring Rhyperia into. Um, I'm going to go back to what I did in the first game, with Venusaur lead, Rhyperia in the back, and Lapras safe swap. Again, just got to be cautious of, of the opposing Venusaur here.
the worst thing that could possibly happen here is a Vespiquen lead. Um, both my, th well, I guess not. Might be the best thing that could happen actually, is I could switch Lapras in to the Vespiquen lead, um, lead to try and draw the Venusaur out, or the Sudowoodo out, which would make it much easier for Rhyperior in the back. So, yeah, As, although I'd lose the lead matchup with Venusaur versus Vespiquen. Uh, that might not be the worst thing in the world because I need Venusaur to beat his Venusaur, really. Um, let's see. Frostlass. That's good. It was a similar thing to the Vespiquen. I've got two counters, so I'll go straight into Lapras. He's staying in. Um, I know he likes a bait, but I think he's got there's too much pressure here, yeah. Um, I'm going to go for the, the Surf, just so I can get Surf damage on him. He will like, he'll shield this. Um, just so I can get him in farming range of my own Venusaur after a few more Ice Shards. Uh, and I know I have to save the shield now uh, for Rhyperia to take on Frostlass. So I'm going to let this through. Obviously I have to go to my own Venusaur. And again, I've got a quite a good IV Venusaur and he might have a bit of energy, so I'm not going to win to MP. It doesn't even get that far. And I know the Sludge Bomb isn't going to kill, so I can over farm a bit. Perhaps it was a mistake on my part, um, shielding the Shadow Ball. Um, that shield might have been more useful on Rhyperia. But we'll see. So I'm able to block. Oh, perfect. So I've got a load of energy on Venus, so I don't need to block here. I can just go straight for the, the Smackdowns. Come on, right, period, lad, do him. Let's see what he goes to. If he goes to Frostlass, I need to throw. If he goes to Venusaur, I need to not. Oh, he's, yeah, he's got too much health. I thought I could get a smack down him. Throw a super power. Oh, flipping heck, yeah. Good job I threw that. So now I've got a shield advantage with Venusaur. So I should be able to finish him off here. This will do a lot of damage if he doesn't kill. And I might just be able to power to, to vine whip him down. No, he's going to get me. Oh, GG's.